What is going on, Safe Moon Army? It is Safe Moon Surge here yet again with another daily video for you all. To all the new viewers, welcome to Safe Moon, the fastest growing crypto community on earth. Now, before we jump into the topic of this video, make sure to come subscribe if you have not yet. Make sure to like, comment, and share this video. I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you for sharing all the love on these videos down here and watching them. I do greatly appreciate you all. Now, let's go ahead and jump into the topic of this video. We're going to look here real quickly at the price of Safe Moon. It is currently still down 2.72% here at 0 0.501418. Current volume is at 6 million, market cap of 830 million. Uh, not too much going on with SafeMoon right now. Um, we've been in the green the last seven or so days, uh, give or take, but not too much going on with the price of SafeMoon. Nothing too exciting. We're obviously all still waiting for the iOS wallet launch as well, but a lot of exciting news. We're going to jump here to uh, Twitter. If you guys haven't, come and follow me at SafeMoon Surge. But first things first, um, I did want to show you guys this right here. So the question was, so 2021 has less than 90 days left and you want to tell me we are getting the card exchange and blockchain. Don't kill my dreams. The answer from John Caroni, Captain Hoddle here, that is what the plan is unless something changes. As we all know, something always changes. So we may not see everything get delivered in 2021, which is only 90 days. It's not a very long period, but also we do know that the exchange and the blockchain will most likely be out this year because they've been alluding to that for a while now. So let's just hope that they can hold the timelines and still give us the exchange and blockchain because that would be amazing, obviously. So this was really good. This was also from Safe Moon Warrior. Wind turbine revenue information compiled by Reddit user, uh, this gentleman here. One, so 0.25 kilowatts. Uh, I'm not really into all this, but here's some math. So according if this is what this is going to be for per turbine, um, it looks like it's going to be 766,500 USD per turbine at 35% efficiency. Um, and so we know that with with the turbines is it's going to actually help with the volume of safe moon if it's at 65 percent efficiency looks like it'll be a million four hundred and twenty three thousand five hundred us dollars per turbine so that is great burn potential per turbine we don't know how many turbines safe moon actually wants to end up using but this is a nice potential burn but it gets better because of if they also double as a service tower for cellular service operations, that is also another source of income. So we do know that this will be huge for SafeMoon once they implement the turbines and then possibly even cellular service operations. So it looks like there's a lot of great things that are going to contribute to the burn. A lot of people have kept asking and kept wondering how is SafeMoon going to be able to contribute more to the burn than it is right now and that is potentially how safe moon hound also tweeted this out if we get an app store change request then 10,000 safe moon army ios beta te testers will be called to duty to carefully intricately and surgically test every single change that they ask of us until we have the most perfect safe moon wallet 10,000 people won't be wrong so it is good that they have those 10,000 beta testers to be able to utilize for Apple uh, if they do request any other changes. We also saw this to the moon. Uh, it's awesome to see the confidence that SafeMoon continues to have, which I love seeing them tweet these types of things out and just giving us more tweets and being more active on Twitter. I did see this as well from SafeMoon Hound. It was a poll. What's next? SafeMoon wallet feature you would like to see add after add custom tokens um, there's an encryption upgrade which 10.8 percent of people uh, wanted fiat to bnb on ramp which was 41.5 d apps and reflections tracker so another one that i saw i don't know if it was on reddit or on twitter it was a, a comment but something someone had mentioned was being able to have like a sell or like a sell button for the amount of reflections you've made something similar to that um 
which I think would be awesome. I think that would be a great feature to be able to just sell the amount of reflections directly uh, without having to take it out and put in how much you want to sell. If it, if you know how many reflections you have, I guess you could just put that in your sell order when you go to sell it um, and just sell the specific reflections that you've made. I guess that could be it. But regardless, though, I think that would be an awesome feature to have as well. But I think a reflections tracker for me personally uh, would probably be the one feature I would love to see. So, um, but let me know what your guys' thoughts are. What type of what feature you guys would like to have on the Safe Moon wallet in the comment section below. And then Safe Moon tweeted this out. Hello, literally everyone at Twitter. Welcome to the Safe Moon Army. This is Safe Moon. Yeah. So it's what we are. It's who we are. We're family. So, um, and then we just have some more replies to people here. Safe Moon replying to Watcher Guru, um, and then Safe Moon replying Hoddle. So, one other thing I wanted to show you guys was uh, this post made by K Jeff here. Um, point of view V2 migration reasoning equals volume. So, that is what we're shooting for. If you look at the highlighted cell, even after consolidation, $10 million of volume at Safe Moon all time high we wouldn't make any significant movement on our growth. SafeMoon decided to fast track token adoption and accessibility as this is the only solid strategy. We need volume that will contribute to burning mechanism. No day trader would touch this token with the fee system except for new money FOMO in. Exchange listings have, sh have showed how the reflection will become an issue. Relying on these factor have proved to be against the project. Bear cycle is a huge risk. Without this bold decision, who's to say SafeMoon can come out from it? Thus, low supply and less zero would help them get better listing, branding, and fund exposure. Hence, accelerate all those planned burn mechanisms, swap, wind turbine, Internet of Things, Project Phoenix. If the use case able to stabilize our burn rate at our all-time high volume, Godspeed. So, yeah, you guys can see here... Um, just kind of explained it real quick of why we need to consolidate because of these reasons right here. Um, we need to know that we are going to be able to get more funding, uh, better listing and branding. So it's why SafeMoon is doing it. It's why it's important. Someone had asked if we're ever going to get on some major listing, exchange listings. This is why they're doing it. So that way we can potentially be on some major exchange. So um, you guys can see here um, just some for some examples, 12 months, 36 months, and then 45 months here. So hopefully this helps. Hopefully this gives you guys some more um, reasoning and explanation on the consolidation. Again, a lot of people are starting to understand what the consolidation is all about and how it's going to play out but i truly believe it'll eventually happen um, another question that was asked if it was going to be manually or automatic i didn't get, hear an answer for that i think it's just going to be automatic once the ios wallet comes out i don't know if it's going to be done manually but regardless though safe moon the safe moon dev team have been working on this and have been anticipating this to an extent already so i'm sure they have everything lined up to make the consolidation smooth which i hope they do but regardless though i think they'll eventually get it all um, done and figured out and then yeah so we're just gonna do a thousand to one is the ratio so you know if you got the new one cent is gonna be everyone talking about when are we gonna hit one one penny um it's gonna be the new goal for us to hit once the consolidation happens is going to be ten dollars so um you know we'll we'll probably lose like about three zeros give or take but um yeah um i'm looking forward to the consolidation i think it's going to be something great for safe moon um and i'm not too worried about it um, but regardless though the burn wallet's going to stay the same so we're still going to receive the same amount of reflections i know a lot of people were worried about that as well but yeah, with that being said, I appreciate all the love and support that you guys have shown on Twitter and even on YouTube. You guys have been awesome. Uh, continue to support this channel. Continue to support uh, me in making these videos. I do greatly appreciate it. And with that being said, I will talk to you all in the next one.